James here, bartenderphd.com here at the show with 2007, and I am with Scott Young again. It's been a year since we've done our interview, so I want to do a year in review here with Scott Young. Scott, first of all, how you doing, buddy? Excellent, man. We had a good year. Okay, tell me a little bit. Of, uh, let's start with uh, what? Uh, I left you in March of last year, 2006. Yeah. What's been going on for your company? Well, I mean, usual things. Obviously, we sell a lot of DVDs around the world. People bring us out to do performances. We, uh, we obviously do a lot of training in bars. We've done a lot of things with, uh, like with sandals. We're in the Caribbean, which has right. been, love the sandals, love the Caribbean anywhere tonight. Um, but I say probably the most exciting thing we've done, uh, two things. We were on uh, Rachel Ray Show. Rachel Ray Show. Rachel now, wait yeah. a second. That was, that's pretty recent then. I mean, she just aired a while ago, no? Exactly, Start, yeah. Or started airing. We were one of the first guests the first couple weeks, actually. So we thought it was really cool. It's actually the biggest, the, as far as we know, it's the big, biggest exposure of flair bartending uh, in, in the world. It was, you know, folks did a little performance. Right. You know, had a little bit of talk and stuff. And uh, they did a great job. So they, went to, they flew to New York and uh, did the big show. And uh, we were really proud of them. So now, also, I heard you guys did a movie or something about a movie? We did. It came out this year. Yeah, it's... Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I'm already laughing. I don't know. I'm already it laughing. We, it was, it's called Bottoms Up. Uh, with, uh, Wait, with Paris Hilton thing? Paris Hilton, uh, yeah. <laughs> we did it with Paris Hilton and uh, um, Jason Muse of uh, Jay and Silent Bob. Um, who else is in? Uh, uh, David Keith, kind of an older time guy. Right, right, right. And uh, Matt Davis. Anyway, yeah, I went to Hollywood. Um, uh, actually, Mike again, one of our best guys. Uh, uh, Mike Adu went down with Tyler uh, Tronis, and uh, they trained the, trained the actors right. for a few days, which was interesting, challenging. We were there for three days, and I think they ended up uh, having about an hour and a half of training. They just didn't, they weren't really there for the so did, flair. Did you guys get a lot of time on air, or did you, did you see the final edit of the movie? We've seen the final edit, and what happened, basically, there, um, uh, they had some clips of which our guys were the body doubles for the two main guys. It was like it was like Johnny Cocktail. Uh, it was, I mean, it's a, it's a full on crazy out there comedy. So, but it was a fun experience for you guys. It was a fun experience. I mean, anytime we get to you know to go down to Hollywood and I mean, the, well, the year before we did the Playboy Mansion performance. So it's uh, there's some really cool things that we get to do. The Playboy yeah. Mansion. I highly recommend it. Uh, okay, so what's now coming up for 2007? What do you got planned? Um, you know, we just we never know who's going to call us. That's why we just, we love this trade show. We get all sorts of contacts. So uh, we possibly might be doing some work with some cruise lines, uh, which is always fun. Uh, we just talked to somebody in Augusta, Georgia. I'm a big golf fan. So if you like golfing, I may actually be able to go to the Masters and train their staff. So uh, so we'll let you know about that one next I have year. a funny feeling the professional golfers might be pretty good at flare bartending. Uh, I think they're, uh, they got definitely. I mean, they got to hit a little ball at the end of a stick way down there, and it goes straight. And I, I know, I know. But, uh, yeah. So we get a lot of stuff going on. We do more performances, and uh, you know, it's another good year. We got some new guys as uh, as instructors, and uh, you know, mom, gotta love mom. Mom's a general manager. Uh, you know what? I mom has been just wonderful working with bartender PhD. Yeah. She's just a sweetheart of a lady. Yeah, totally. you may. You may only get to ever hear her voice when working with this company, but she's just a wonderful lady. And then finally, yeah. what? Uh, give me a really quick, like, one minute of the high points of your company and what it is you're focusing on? Well, as always, we're really focused on creating a fantastic guest experience, and there's a lot of ways to do that. Certainly, we're known for the, I don't know if you get a little bit of this, I mean, this very simple working flair, right, that doesn't have to actually take any time, you know, a little pour, snap, you know, basic stuff. Wow. Right? But it doesn't have to slow you down, just simple stuff. We can go harder for sure, but that's what we focus on, is getting people having some tools uh, to be excited about their job, interact with the guests, uh, you know, bar bets, tricks and challenges, and little jokes here and there, and uh, you know, increasing your sales revenue. So it's all these things that we really try to teach, but it's about the fun factor. you got to create the fun. If you're having fun and your staff is enjoying right. themselves, right. you will make more money, I guarantee it. So now, really, so then if I was to learn how to maybe just do the, some of the most basic sure. flare moves, you it would increase the tips and the uh, and the the imaging of the bar and the friend friendliness of it. And, Absolutely. Uh, I mean, we teach the way we teach flair. Just in short, we teach working flair, which is basic stuff. What I just showed you. We recommend you do one to five moves for every drink. Just just bursts, little bursts. And the only, I'm sorry, the only move I do is put the ice in the thing and I just pour it. That's a good start, man. That's a good start. you got to do it with some passion. So just a few moves. And then three, four, five times a, a, an hour, you bust out a little mini performance, a little 10, 15 second burst of, of the higher wow factor moves. Right. And that way you sort of keep this going all night. Always keep them wanting for more, but you're pumping out the drinks at a high volume. Everybody's having a good time. They get the wow factor and everybody makes more money. Well, it's another year here at the show, 2007. I'm so stoked to have rolled up here on Scott Young and Mom and everybody here from ExtremeBartending.com. This is Jeeves here, Bartender PhD, with Scott Young. 
Stick around because it's going to be a hot 2007 here for Scott Young and right. Mom and team. Right. Later. Right. Later.